lovely to share my book, The Lost Voices, today. My launch, and thank you so much for hosting it. Um, what I wanted to ask you both was, what do you think the impact of the story will be um, on the children at HLC? So I think um, children will really tap into that um, hearing and believing that their voice is powerful and that what they are able to do with that voice can really um, have further actions along the line as well. So um, that kind of magical feel of believing in yourself and we really promote that as a school anyway. If your voice counts, what can you do with it? And the way that you've pulled out all the vocabulary along with that and giving that empowering message, I think is really important. And everything that that's, you know, aligns with what we want to do as a school as well, make sure children believe in themselves and actually can go on to do whatever they want to do um, by being empowered by themselves and driven. Yeah, and it's really that, that uniqueness that I wanted to share with them today and I think they really captured that when I was going around for year twos, you could really feel that. Um, I think what I'd like to ask, so if, if a colleague um, at a different school said to you, um, you know, we've read this story, The Lost Voices, you know, what would you say to them about the experience of having an author in and, and sharing this book? I think for me, it just opens children. It broadens horizons for me. Seeing different, one, seeing an author, so just a different vocation as well, and something that they potentially could go into in the future. And a story opens so many worlds, and there's it, an insight into a different world and a different point of view. Um, it, you know, children may come from a certain background and a certain um, mindset in a family, but this can broaden that. And I just think it's so valuable and so important that. You know, we reflect society and reflect everything that's out there so they've got every opportunity as they grow grow up and grow older and journey through education yeah definitely and i just think with you being a local author mm. as well it's really relatable the children can see that authors are real that they can become that that it doesn't have to be someone that they see on the t television or anything like that but actually this can happen and when you really believe in yourself and want to pursue it you can do it it's very inspirational <laughs> thank you so much thank you both thank you thank you <laughs>